get so cold in the winter and so hot in the summer? Well, it all has to do with Earth's relationship to the sun. Earth continually spins. We know this because we have daytime and we have nighttime. Earth spins on an imaginary line going from the North Pole to the South Pole. This line is called the axis. The Earth also has an imaginary line going through the middle of it called the equator. This divides Earth into the Northern Hemisphere and the Southern Hemisphere. As the Earth spins on its axis, some parts experience nighttime and some parts experience daytime. It takes 24 hours for the Earth to spin around one time. That's why there are 24 hours in a day. Can you imagine if the Earth spun around really fast? Whoa, whoa. Clean up, aisle four please. Not only does the Earth spin around, it also circles the sun. It takes 365 days, one year, to circle the sun. Let's look at our Earth again. Do you notice anything? The Earth is slightly tilted. It is this tilt that creates the season. Each season lasts about three months. In this example, the northern hemisphere is tilted towards the sun, making it summer, and the southern hemisphere is tilted away from the sun, making it winter. In three months, as the Earth continues its journey around the sun, it becomes fall in the northern hemisphere and spring in the southern hemisphere. When the Earth travels for another three months, it's winter in the northern hemisphere and summer in the southern hemisphere. Three more months, and it's spring in the northern hemisphere and fall in the southern hemisphere. So you see, the Earth's tilt in relationship to the sun is what makes the seasons. Consider yourself brain zapped. Thanks for watching.